guaranteed to make any vegetarian's mouth water is this appetizing spread prepared by young housewife Margaret Hobbs for a particularly distinguished group of residents at her husband's farm in Haroldwood, Essex. Needless to say, from a glance at the dining arrangements, you'll gather the guests are not human. They are, in fact, providers of one of the world's rarest and most expensive furs, white and golden nutria. This, then, is the South American Koipu, 32 of which were recently brought over from the United States by young breeder Eric Hobbs to add to his large collection of mink and chinchilla. Some may not look very valuable, and that's because the prime fur is concealed beneath long guard hair under the stomach. Strangely enough, nutria are the greatest freaks in fur farming, with the head of a beaver, the hind and webbed feet of a duck, whiskers of a walrus, tail of a rat, and body of a groundhog. However, some of these mutations are useful because the long guard hair can be used for felt, the whiskers for paintbrushes, and the orange ivory teeth for costume jewelry. While admittedly beauty is only skin deep, there's no denying that the chinchilla makes a most appealing picture. Chinchilla, the most expensive of furs, apart from the very rare white koipu, is not particularly rare these days. Yet as recently as 1920, they were thought, after centuries of ruthless trapping, to be extinct. Then, however, an American mining engineer was granted permission to search the Andes of South America for any survivors of this beautiful breed, and after three years discovered one small family of 11. Today's considerable population of chinchillas are descended from those. Among the reasons for their value, the average chinchilla coat costs between seven and 10,000 pounds, is the remarkable lightness of the fur. One square yard of chinchilla being the same weight as a square yard of silk or rayon. And even more incredible is the fact that the hairs are so fine that the human hand is not sensitive enough to feel the texture at first. To keep that fluffiness, they have a daily powder bath. Here's one animal that takes a pride in her appearance. She's good and she knows it.